now the question before us is gopi buys a fish from a shop for his aquarium the shopkeeper takes out one fish at random from a tank containing five male fish and eight female fish what is the probability that the fish taken out is a male fish so now what is given here total number of fish total number of fish is equal to number of male fish plus number of female fish so the total number of male fish given in the question are 5 number of female fish are 8 so the total number of fish as given in the question are 13 so now we are to calculate the probability that the fish taken out is a male fish so now the number of male fish is equal to 5 this is given in the question now we are to calculate the probability fish taken out is a male fish so here we will write number of favorable outcomes divided by total number of possible outcomes or we can say that on the upper hand we will write the number of male fish or we can say that here we will write the total number of fish so male fish are 5 the total number of fish or the total number of outcomes possible outcomes are 13 so this is the probability that the fish taken out is a male fish is 5 over 13 this is the answer next part now the question before us is a game of chance consists of spinning an arrow which comes to rest pointing out at one of the numbers 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 so these are the numbers which have been given to us 1 3 4 5 6 7 8 so when we rotate it eight times there is a possibility that we will get the arrow pointing out at a only one time so now we will calculate the probability arrow pointing at eight so here we will write number of favorable outcomes divided by total number of possible outcomes so here in the first part of the question eight appears only once that is when we rotate the arrow or spin an arrow eight times there is the possibility that we will get eight only one time so we here give 
one on the upper hand and the total number of possible outcomes that means that we have to rotate it eight times these are the all possible outcomes so this is the answer for the first part next next is what is the probability that the arrow will point out at an odd number first of all it is necessary for us to know what is the meaning of odd number here we have been given the numbers 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 odd numbers that can be outcome from this given question are 1 3 5 and 7 so these are 4 in total odd numbers that can be outcome are 1 3 5 and 7 so the number of odd numbers or number of favorable outcomes so far as the second part of the question is concerned these are four odd numbers are four because these are one this is second this is third this is fourth so now we are to point calculate the probability arrow pointing an odd number so here on the upper hand we will write the number of favorable outcomes this is the four so the total number of outcomes are one to eight eight so the probability of arrow pointing an odd number is one over two next part what is the probability that it will point at a number greater than 2 so again we write the numbers 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 what is the question that it will point out a number greater than 2 that is the probability of this part is to be calculated that the arrow will point out at either 3 4 5 or 6 or 7 or 8 so the numbers greater than 2 is equal to 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So, the number of numbers, total numbers greater than 2 or number of numbers greater than 2, these are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 or we can count here 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, we are here to calculate the probability arrow pointing at a number greater than 2 is equal to here we will write the number of favorable outcomes. The number of favorable outcomes are here this 6. What is the total number of outcomes, possible outcomes? These are all 6 over 8. We will divide both sides by 2. This is the answer of probability of the arrow pointing at a number greater than 2. So now, next, what is the probability that the arrow will point out at a number less than 9. What is given? These numbers are given to us. What we are to calculate? Number less than 9. So, we write here numbers less than 
नाइन वट आर द नंबर विच आर लैस दैन नाइन वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सैवन एंड एट दैट इज ऑल द नंबर विच आर गिवन हेयर आर लैस दैन सो द नंबर ऑफ नंबर लैस दैन नाइन इज ऑल द नंबर दैट इज द एट सो probability arrow pointing at a number less than 9 is equal to number of favorable outcomes 8 number of all possible outcomes that is the total number this is also 8 numbers less than 9 this is also 8 both the items are 8 so our probability comes as 1 this is the answer because all the numbers have to be taken into consideration because all the numbers are less than 9 we hope you might have understood this question thanks for watching if you like our course please spare some time to give a star rating to our course